celebrating Baby Metal and the new album Metal Resistance out right now. And it is my honor to give you Mo Metal, Yui Metal, and Su Metal, the disciples of the Fox God, Baby Metal. Thank you so much for coming today. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, also, my lovely co-host today, Lee Barton. Uh, I will give the mic to you so you can introduce yourself. Hi, everyone. I'm Lee. I'm a big fan of Baby Metal. I was introduced to them by a friend who saw one of their performance videos and was just like, this is totally you. Like, you love J-pop. You love metal. Like, all the whole package. So, big fan of the band. Um, now we're going to listen to a short clip of one of their fan favorite songs. Give me a All right, welcome back, everybody. All right, we're going to ask Baby Metal some questions Questions a little bit later. But right now, we're going to talk about Metal Resistance. So, girls, uh, first of all, uh, what is Metal Resistance to you? So, this Metal Resistance, the title of the album, is a word that 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 is a word 音楽って国境だったりとかそういうジャンルを超えて一つになることができる音楽だなっていうのを感じてなので今回のメタルレジスタンスというアルバムタイトルに私たちの成長だったりとかそういう挑戦っていうものを詰め込みました。So metal resistance is a word that they that has been used by Bay Metal um, in the past for their tours, also their world tours, and it basically represents the path that they are on right now. And that is their, this is their metal resistance. Um, what they realized through touring so far is that language, not language, music has no um, barrier. It's, it's, it transcends every barrier. There's no, I mean, everybody can come together with uh, music. And that is exactly what um, metal resistance stands for. Um, it's what they want to do and what they aim to do um, with this album. Right, thank you. Obviously, that is Baby Metal's translator, so everybody can understand. Uh, this wonderful meeting we have right now. So, girls, uh, the new record is really great. I've found myself listening to it almost nonstop since I found it. It makes me extremely happy every, every time I listen to the record. It makes me so happy. Uh, so, you've shown a lot of maturity on this record. Um, so, tell me, how were you able to challenge yourself in the studio when creating Metal Resistance? はい、えっと、今回のアルバムは本当にたくさんのことに挑戦したので、私たちの成長とか挑戦とかが本当にたくさん詰まったアルバムになっています。そして、挑戦したことの例を挙げるとすれば、ラップメタルっていうものに挑
like Awadama Fever about bubblegum. How could you not love that? Uh, so can you tell me about some of your favorite lyrics and um, what are some of the lyrical themes that you decided to sing about on this one? そうですね。このアルバムには結構前向きな言葉がたくさん詰まっているなっていうふうに思っていて、私のはメタルの音楽ってすごく心を動かすものだと思っているんですけど、それに前向きな歌詞を追加することによって、なんかよりポップな感じになるというか、より明るく明るい気持ちになれるなっていうふうに思っていて、私が一番好きな歌詞はロードオブレジスタンスの中のくじけても何度でも心の炎を燃やせっていう歌詞がいつも励まされています。Um, for Sumail, she says that you know, the lyrics this time in Metal Resistance has a lot of positive elements.、Um, and you know, for her, metal is a type of music that really pierces your heart. But by implementing or including、um, lyrics that are more positive, it makes somehow it adds a little pop element or maybe something that's brighter to the metal side of things.、Um, so that is why one of the, her favorite lyrics actually is、um, from the song Root of Resistance. Um, where it says that you know, no matter how you fall and no matter、um, how hard things can be, like always light that fire in you because you just have to go on. So that's one of the lyrics that she really likes, and I mean that's that is what、um, is that is among one of the themes that is、um, that their lyrics are about this time. Thank you,、uh, and of course one of the the newest single that you've released is the one,、uh, some very beautiful beautiful singing in English. Uh, also, the video is very cool. You、uh, uh, descending down from the big triangle into the、yeah. giant, giant、yeah. group of fans down there.、Uh, can you tell us a little bit about the one and why it's important to sing in English on this track for you guys? So, this is the way that the live is going to be able to do it. So, this is the way that the 私たちは基本的に日本語で歌を歌っているんですけど私たちの歌詞である日本語を勉強して一緒に歌ってくださる方がたくさんいるのを知って私たちも英語でいつか歌ってみたいなっていう思いがあったんですけど、まあ、でもこの「メタルレジスタンス」の中で「ザワンっていう曲は私たちにとってすごく大切な曲になっていて音楽の力でみんなを一つにしていこうってやっぱりそのためにはこの思いをちゃんと多くの人に届けたいなっていう思いがあったので、今回レコーディングとかはすごく大変だったんですけど、でも英語詞全編英語詞に挑戦できてすごく良かったなって思っています。Um, Sumail says that you know one thing they realize at the concerts、um, abroad outside Japan, you know their most of their music are sung in Japanese, but despite of that, like fans are coming over to concerts and singing along, everybody singing along in Japanese. Um, and just looking at that, sometimes it's, you know, it's, it's very emotional for her. So that's why always, you know, it has always been in her mind is that one day we're going to sing an English song. So this time for Metal Resistance, they took the opportunity、um, to work on a full English track, which is the one. And because the lyrics、um, is about you know, bringing everybody together through their music, and they want to make sure that everybody can understand the messages that they want to put across. So, it's a very important song for them, and they thought, you know, we need to do this in English、um, to be able to really get the message、um, across. And yeah,、um, hopefully, this worked this time. She said also, recording was very tough, but in the end, it came out as a very,、um, she hopes that it came out good. Yes,、yeah, a great, great closing track for the record. And you recently debuted some new songs at the Wembley gig that you just did, a gigantic show. I see a lot of people are talking about that show online. A lot of people are talking about raising the flags and what an amazing moment that was.、Um, so,、uh, you debuted songs like Matatoro for the first time live.、Uh, what other songs that you haven't played yet do you think you'll be playing when you finally do this big world tour? そうですねとウェンブリーアリーナのステージで初めて披露した曲はたくさんあったんですけど特にまあメタ太郎はずっと私たちにとってもファンの方と一緒に歌ったり踊ったりしたい曲っていう話をしていたのでメタ太郎の曲が流れた瞬間にお客さんが一緒にメタ太郎って一緒に歌ってくださったんでやっぱりそれはすごく興奮したしなんかこういうふうに。日本語の歌詞をまた広められることができて嬉しいなって思いました。Um, it was true at Wembley Arena, the show at Wembley Arena, which just happened a few days ago,、um, that Baby Metal played 
a few songs from their new album for the very first time. And so when they played, one of the songs was Meta Taro. And um, it was really amazing because uh, Sumail said that as soon as the intro of the song came up, people were already singing along to the song. You know, it's a new song, and it's the first time they played it, but people were already singing along. Um, and yeah, it was, again, it was just an amazing, amazing experience for them. Um, but as, yeah, and, and hopefully, of course, they're also going to be playing it um, on their upcoming tours and seeing other songs being performed live, live as well. Awesome, glad to hear it. Uh, we're going to cut back to a little bit of music right now. Uh, the first single released off this new record, Karate, enjoy, stick around, we'll be right back. more questions from the girls. Um, so, you guys have shared the stages with a ton of legendary bands. Who would you like to be on a lineup with next? Limp Bizkit. Metallica. Bring me the horizon. Bring me the horizon. Okay. <laughs> Very cool, guys. Um, also, what other music do you like to listen to besides metal? I really love Ariana Grande. <laughs> Ariana Grande. All right, good pop. <laughs> and uh, lastly, you guys have a really crazy touring schedule. What do you like to do on your days off? I love touring. I love. I love. Sorry. I love trying new food. Okay, cool. New food. Yeah. What's your favorite? I love Deutsch no tabemono. German food. Okay. German food? Yeah. Cool. So now we're going to go to some questions from the Twitch fans. Would you like to start off? Sure. Actually, let's see. All right, Twitch fans, let's see what your questions are. All right, let's see what everyone's coming up. So many of them are coming up, so. Uh, I've been seeing some people talk about what's your favorite part of being on tour? Favorite part? ツアーで一番好きなことは新しいお客さんにどんどんたくさん会えることです。えっと、いつもたくさんライブをしていくたびに新しいお客さんの発見とかいろんなものを感じることができるし、ベビーメタルを um, UML says that you know the thing that she looks forward to the most when she's on tour is um, that in meeting new fans or you know seeing what fans or who would show up at their concerts and shows because it's always very uh, interesting and you know, the fact that people come like every, every city that I go you know to meet new people. Um, it means that people are enjoying baby metal, and you know that is always something that's you know she's very happy to see people enjoying you know what they're doing right now. So yeah, definitely that like meeting and seeing who comes to their shows. All right, where have you guys not toured yet, but hope to perform for soon? Australia, Australia, Moa Metal says she would like to go to Australia and hug a koala as she's on stage or perform with a hugging 
performing while hugging a koala. That's going to be dangerous. Those things are deadly. Very cute, mm. sharp yeah. claws. Yeah. Wow. But, uh, very, but it's cute. Um, okay, let's see. What else do you guys have? Come on, bring the questions on. But Australia would be awesome. Okay. Keep them coming. Keep them coming. Um, fans can expect on the tour. Hardest dance. Um, well, I see a lot of people are asking more about the Wembley show, especially about the, the flags. Uh, I guess everyone's really, everyone wants to know how did you feel when you raised the flags at Wembley? I guess it was a very iconic moment that a lot of people are, were very excited about. So, this is the Wembley Arena. The show is in Egyptian, the Sankaime, the Tanode, the Sai Show, the Tachi, the Kek San, the Tempo, the Tsukam, the Nisugoku, the Tsuk, 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 um, Sumel says that at Wembley Arena, at the beginning of the show, you know, they were trying to catch up, they were trying to, you know, synchronize with the audience, and the audience is, there's a lot of new people there at the show, so people were just trying to catch up with each other. So in the beginning, it was a little bit rough, but then as, you know, they went through the set, things got... Um, things went smoother and then people were really enjoying themselves and they were enjoying themselves but at the very end and especially at the very end um, that was when they played Road of Resistance and that's when they were raising the flags um, that was when she was again reminded um, by how music really can bring people to together and she felt that you know, they were able to do this because that's always been their aim um, to bring everybody, you know, to become one with everyone and uh, with all of their fans at Wembley. So, um, and Sumel says that she thinks they did it at Wembley Arena. They made it happen. They did become one of all the fans, especially when they were playing the last two songs. It was the one followed by Road of Resistance. Great, yeah. Lots of people, I see tons of people talking about those flags, so... Awesome. Obviously, it was very successful uniting everybody as one. Uh, take the next question, why don't you? All right. So the fans would love to know, it seems. What can they expect from your upcoming tour? So this is the end of the tour. In the end of the tour, it will be the end of the tour of America. We have never been to the end of the tour. We have never been to the end of the tour. We have never been to the end of the tour. どんな人が待ってるのか、どんな街なのか、まあどんな美味しい食べ物があるのかも含めて、すごくいろんな意味で楽しみなんですけど、まあとこれからきっと新曲などもたくさん披露していくと思うので、皆さんと一緒に新しい曲をどんどん作っていけたらいいなって思っています。Um, on this upcoming tour, they'll be visiting a lot of new cities that they've never been to before, so that's super exciting.、Um, you know, checking out the, you know, they love to check out new food. They love to check out how the city is. They walk about the city. So looking forward to that.、Um, and obviously, it's going to be a chance for them to play music from Metal Resistance, from the new album Metal Resistance, live for、um, fans to come out to the show.、Um, of course, new songs that they've not performed yet, perhaps. And another thing is, you know,、um, Sumail says that they always, their songs are always like growing with them. With the fans, so it's like you know, trying to see how 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 their songs will、um, develop from from now on through their live performances. Great.、Uh, another question I've been saying is,、uh, do any of you play any instruments? Obviously, besides singing. I can play the guitar. Guitar? Yeah. What do you like to play? Eh? <laughs> she says she'll leave that up to your imagination. Secret. <laughs>、uh, any of you other girls play any instruments? No, yet. No, not yet. 
What's your favorite song from the new album? はい、えっと、アルバムの中で一番好きな曲は私はロードオブレジスタンスです。えっと、この曲はたくさんのライブで披露してきたので、思い出もたくさん詰まってるし、感想の部分では新ガロングする部分があって、お客さんと心が一つ
Great, all right. Uh, we're gonna go to a little bit of music right now before we say goodbye to the girls. This is another new one from Metal Resistance. It is the one. Check it out in English. Enjoy. Uh, thank you everyone for coming. Uh, I've seen so many people from so many different places. Russia, Germany I see, the UK, uh, Brazil, <laughs> like so many places. It's so cool. Uh, also, really important, if you don't know this already, the girls are going to perform tomorrow on The Late Show with Stephen Colbert. That's so cool. Uh, tomorrow night at I think uh, 11.30 I think the show's on. Uh, so be sure to check that out, uh, set your DVRs and all that. Uh, girls, uh, you, you must be excited. The first ever uh, television performance for you in America. Are you excited? What are you feeling? Hi, it's a very good thing. I'm going to be a little bit of 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 a たくさんの方にベビーメタルの音楽を知ってもらえるチャンスなので、皆さん私たちのことこのこの番組を見てくださっている方がお友達に伝えてこのザレイト賞を見てくださればうれしいなと思うので、皆さんぜひ見てください。uh, Mo Metal says that, you know, of course, it's super, super psyched for um, to appear on The Late Show. Um, but at the same time, you know, a little bit nervous because they don't know what to expect. I mean, it's your first ever um, American uh, TV appearance. Um, but at the same time, it's also an opportunity for them to reach out to people who have no idea who Baby Metal are. So they're super excited for that to get new people, you know, into Baby Metal. Um, and, you know, and, and of course, um, Momelo is doing a shout out to everybody watching uh, them on Twitch tonight to tell all of their friends that uh, to tune in uh, to CBS tomorrow to catch them on the late show. Yes, CBS, I'm very jealous you're going to meet Stephen Colbert. He's the <laughs> man. Uh, yes, everyone, everyone shouting out from their countries now Austria, Czech Republic, Ireland, uh, so many, God, Portugal. Peru. Peru. Yeah. So many awesome people. Thank you so much, everybody. It's awesome to see uh, people from around the world uniting in support of this group. It's a really awesome group, so new and refreshing. Uh, it's awesome to have sort of this little revolution happening in metal right now for this very special band. And of course, Metal Resistance is out in stores now. Buy it, listen to it, much like we have. It will make you happy. Thank you very much. Thank you, Lee. Thank you, girls. We appreciate you so much. Thank you so much. Thank Hungary, so much. England, everybody, Philippines, wow. New Jersey Ooh. is one. Wow. All right. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, so, thank you so much, everybody. Thank you for tuning in. Yeah. Good night. See you. <laughs> See you.